I believe that Newton's first law of motion is the reason we will emerge from our current economic woes. That law states that an object at rest tends to stay at rest and an object in motion to stay in motion with the same speed and in the same direction unless upon by an unbalanced force. How does that relate to the financial as number sign, dollar sign, percent symbol, and asterisk symbol storm we're now cowering under? Allow me to explain. There are slightly less than 7 billion people on this planet. Assuming that roughly half that number are e either too young, too old, too lazy, or too loaded to work. That still leaves, wait, that still leaves almost three and a half billion people getting up in the morning. Uh, uh, or to chase the almighty dollar, the transcendent rupee, the zen, the yen, the dear uh, oh, euro, the what's going on you on the well you get the idea now call me crazy and many have called me far worse but i happen to think that three and a half billion motivated people is one big damn object in motion and the only thing acting against that object is the friction caused by the small bunch of greedy dumbass screw the horse ivy league pot stickers the unbalanced force i therefore assert the unbalanced force you know who you are shame on you will eventually be overwhelmed by by of uh, the object in motion three and a half billion people with buck also known as buckers thus allowing the object in motion to continue its relentless journey forward thriving and kniving kniving until it is once again slowed down by other unbalanced forces for a very large meteorite or a plug or fundam fundamentalists with nukes or atmosphere eating nanobots or a supervolcano or skynet or clients